Hello everybody and welcome to game number three of Geordie Go in the OCC and I've got a hundred petty cash um, I've only got 11 players so I guess I'll go for two babes because he'll probably beat the crap out of me unless I get lucky um, he has two Bloxaurus and an Apothecary Whereas I have a dead ghoul and a dead zombie, I replace my dead white. Um, but it's and I've got a, I've got blocking a werewolf, but it's it's looking grim, pretty grim. Yeah, I'm looking pumped for this. Well, it's it's dire, isn't it? It's it's fucking Kieran Dyer. It's who I should have got for this game, because. It fucking is dire. I don't see how I can... Like, maybe I could get... I mean, maybe if I just get loads of removals. If my claw if my claw kicks the shit out of him, I've got a chance. If my claw doesn't kick the shit out of him, I don't have a chance. That, that's just all it, all it comes down to. St. James's Park. I like the Dwarf Stadium the best. Isn't that crazy? Oh, I hate dwarves. I do like the stadium. Hi. Best of luck and good fun. That's what I honestly mean. <laughs> Likewise. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty good though that it looks like Newcastle with a brown ale. Uh, um. Oh, he's just letting me blitz that guy. Alright. What's gonna fucking go wrong to stop... To stop that happening, I wonder. Rob Lee can get this gorgeous because it actually looks like him. And obviously having block guys on the line would be good. But, um, seeing as... I've only got three agility three players, I can't really do that. No, no, I concede. It's bad luck. Get fucked. Is um, is is what it actually is. But for a joke, we say best of luck and good fun. Thank you, VIP Kurgol. I need it. And now it's another perfect defense. So last game, last game, I faced a perfect defense and a blitz. And this game, I instantly the worst team in the entire game. To get a perfect defense against you is lizard men. <laughs> I knew it would go wrong when he just sacrifices a fucking saurus to me. He just gives me a saurus to eat. Oh, fuck my life. It's just unbelievable, isn't it? It's unbelievable. Every time I'm going to get... I mean, that wasn't a surf, but every time I'm going to get a surf somebody, I don't get to surf them. And this was... This was just hit somebody effectively. Not even allowed to happen. He's going to have to go and hit him because he's the only one he can get safe after hitting. Is safe now, does he? Hmm. 
<laughs> yeah, I know. It's, I'll never remember my password again because of that VIP the waitress. Well, it could have gone worse. Could have gone worse, so considering you got a fucking perfect fan, I'm freaking freezing as well, I should put the heat on. Yeah, it's funny because I just use, you know, like. Um. What was I saying? Um. One in ten billion. Seventeen percent pickup. Do it, Lewis. Why is it 1 in 10 billion? I'm sure it's not 1 in 10 billion. It must be the precise manner of the scatter that happens here. Alright, he was just somebody who can't do maths. I thought it was funny. I thought it was funny. 100... One in sixty-four. One in sixty-four, not even crazy. Or one in sixty-five. Idea. VIP the Waitrix, no idea. One dice him. I've got it all. Oh, got it. I can surf him straight up then, can't I? Got to go for this cheeky one dicer. Thank you very much. That was crazy that you let me do that, wasn't it? Double surf now. Can he, um... Surf the ball, that's what I'm thinking, if I um, make it two dice. Should be safe, shouldn't I? Injury! <laughs> Holy shit! Well, uh, I certainly um, like the way he's playing this one so far. Fondlers of balls, and they might not allow that. <laughs> I guess I just want to keep his men. He's, he's blocking me anyway, so I might as well get more men in contact here. I mean, he could do some. He could do some tricks here, couldn't he? But 
And not in not in Blood Bowl 2, okay, no. You should, in the rules of Blood Bowl. Did he get minus agility? So, yeah, he won't even get minus. He won't even miss next game, then. Lucky for him. Oh, he's got block. He re rolls, he realizes he's going to get surfed now. <laughs> like, Kaz is he's like, oh, right. That's what happens. That's what happens against werewolves. All right, I'll re-roll it then. I mm, remember a bribe, it wasn't, I didn't get a bribe, I got, um, I got two babes, Pedro Jack, to stop me getting banged on. Ah, they will though. They, they will no doubt frown on it. They also say fuck, don't they, in game? I'm pretty sure, or couldn't, or twat, or something like that. What's this little skink gonna do? Skinky McSkinkerson. He's gonna go for the one die. Absolute madman. Gets the power, unbelievable. Saves his guy from getting served. I was hoping you would dodge away at the... I thought you'd been scared and dodged away. That's what I was hoping. Because um, if he had dodged... Well, I could have done exactly what I'm about to do now. Which is 2D as Crocs. And... Then followed. Guess I'm not going to follow now, seeing as I didn't knock him down. But I would have followed then. Would have followed one diced him. And then... Uh, and then followed, and then he could have come to here. He could have he could have two D'd him, and then he could have run in and surfed him. Would have been really funny, but um, not to be. I don't even need. To, I don't even get to do anything now, do I? I don't think I should have maybe waited on standing him up. I don't even get to do anything this turn. Fuck. for a dodge get stunned lose the ball say GG two players up and, and completely unable to protect the ball hand egg throwers fair enough yeah ball fondlers would probably I imagine would be frowned upon Right, I need to um I need to fucking put some heating on here. Absolutely freezing. That was good, that double surf, though, wasn't it? I mean, that should that should make it somewhat easy, but unfortunately, it looks like it's not going to be too easy. Only one player up. Because it's hard for the dog to even hit anybody, isn't it? That's the thing. He's fucking. He's got such a strength advantage. Like, realistically, I want to be hitting the strength 4 guys rather than the strength 2 guys with him. So his claw does something, but still with block and frenzy, he can certainly hit skinks if he gets the chance. But um, if he doesn't, 
He can't. And it's hard without, without having goals. I've got no, no movement at all. Two into a one, fuck it. Should have maybe moved the ball first, eh? And I wish I'd got a bribe now. Okay, wouldn't it? If I had a bribe, but obviously not without one. God, my team's so shit. It's unbelievable how shit my team is. I feel like I'm down many, even though I'm up. It's bad that two. It's bad that he's as sore as down for the whole match, and I still feel completely up against it. That's crazy, isn't it? That's crazy. Yeah, he's gonna hit my wolf. Hello, no alias. Long time no see. Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna fucking get his. I mean, you might even blitz with the Crocs, might you? Get mighty blow hit on. But I guess he's gonna blitz with this guy, and that's why he didn't stand up before. Yeah, lizards are disgusting. Lizards are an absolutely disgusting team. But especially with with Necro because you know, your you, frenzy's a nega trait, isn't it, against them a lot of the time. It's the definition of a double edged sword against these fuckheads. To block him and then push him to there, but then I can't surf him. But at least I could get away, maybe somehow. Oh, I could push my flesh eater here, then he could push him to there. I'll just push him out and then get the blitz in here. I can probably 2D him. Somehow. It means making a loner block first action, but fuck else am I gonna do? So now I've got. Can one dice him? Which then, then means I can blitz with my arm. Uh, one dice into a minus two, so I just blitz this little shit. Hopefully, kill him. Yeah. 
You can probably do some kind of chain push here, but I just honestly don't care. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so I'm so done with OCC already. It's like I just I just honestly don't even care about the whole league. <laughs> Which is a shame, because, but even if I'd done well, I'd find it hard to care, because it's 40 games to get to the top flight, minimum, just because I missed the first five games. It just pissed me off. Oh, good, he didn't pound. He didn't didn't surface at least yet. But I'm sure he can surf the ball or something here, can't he? Not even hard. Not even hard to surf the ball, but I just I just don't care. Hard to care. Hard to care when, when like this game isn't even got badly, but it's just like I don't know how how I'm supposed to win. Brutal, isn't it? Just blitzing the wolf. That's good for me, I guess. At least I can have some fleshies in there, should. They should be able to hold the line. Yeah, there's a rush to get there, Tob. I don't want to fucking dick around in pointless divisions for four, 43. Yeah, you, yeah, it was shit by me. Yeah, it's true. Um, 43 weeks. That's a lot of time in real life, isn't it? I mean, that, that's without the time in between seasons. So you basically a whole year. Of not being able to win win the OCC, that's that's not what I'm about. I want to win it. I don't want to fucking dick around in low divisions. I don't want to fucking team build. I want to win. I basically can't. Don't have the chance to. Going for a foul. Free thirty percent to kill a skink. Looks good. AV9, thick school regen. Terrible, terrible foul here. Of course he gets the KO. Of course he does. Standard. Unbelievable, Jeff. Let's go for the one dicer here. Got him. Okay, two dice are now, don't I? <laughs> it's a loner. Might as well try and reroll it. No, of course not. Now he must he must surf the ball now. Alright, good. I've just quit all CC just now, I think. I probably should have done kills you too fast. I probably should have done dark elves. But um I didn't I think I think Necro are really good, it's just they've got a bit of a bit of a bad start, haven't they? That's it. They just got a bit of a bad start, that's all. Obviously, um, to be fair, if I'd gone Dark Elves, I'd still be doing shit after getting three players killed first game. 
what I mean now, I'm not even trying. I don't I don't know what the fuck I'm doing right now, to be honest. But I'm just trying to make it end as soon as possible, I guess. Yeah, he could even even he even even he couldn't mess it up now, could he? It was too easy, it was just too easy. Good. Zero and three in OCC. I'm so happy. I mean, at least at least I'll I'll fucking see it out um, this time. Unlike the first time I was in OCC, um, at least I will. At least I will see out this this league. Got a GFI, so he can't knock me into into another um, Saurus. How him? Good. All right. This is going great. They've got an even. They've, yeah, I won't be really rolling UK BBL. No, exactly VIP the Waitrix. Un, no, they don't have a bad match matchup. Um, like Wood Elves is a bit dodgy, um, and Undead is like even. But they don't have a bad matchup. Woody's is overstated. Obviously, Woody's with strip ball it becomes very hard for them. But at a thousand TV, it's not that hard. It's not that hard because the Woodies only have two re rolls. And they're, um, you know, they're armor seven, so you got to knock them all down. They don't have loads of dodge and shit. Obviously, once Woody's get dodge and strip, then it becomes very hard because it's really hard for wizards to get tackle, isn't it? So, and obviously Zons, Zons is pretty, Zons is pretty bad for them. Yeah, Norse can go bad, Dwarves can go bad. Yeah. In, but it's it's not really a bad matchup, I wouldn't say. If I get pushed here, can I still score? One, two, three, four, five, six, two, five. I could have done so. I did set up correctly. I'm in with a shot here. Unbelievably. Unbelievably, despite basically trying to lose. In with a shot. It's amazing that I, I first turn, like, turn one or two, I fucking serve two players. And it's still been a fucking nightmare. Isn't that crazy? It's unbelievable. It's fucking unbelievable that it's been so hard after surfing two players instantly. Holy shit. Right. Um, he can't score now, at least. Maybe I should have got these guys off the sideline, but I just don't really care. There's a chance, isn't there? So red, orange worth it in it. Sir Alan Shearer, holy shit! 
<laughs> fucking crazy. Absolutely fucking crazy. Rolls a one for the KO. Um Well, my luck hasn't been bad this game, has it? I mean, I've played absolutely fucking terrible. <laughs> there's no doubt about... <laughs> there's no doubt about how fucking terribly I've played. Um, well, I mean, the first turn was good. When I surfed two guys. Or the second turn, whatever it was. But after that, I've played garbage. Well played. <laughs> I can't believe his foul worked and he hasn't come back. It's outrageous. And hopefully this guy stays out. Yeah, it's funny, isn't it? It's funny how it works, how the dice can decide. I mean, I've made loads of one dices because I couldn't do anything else. He made a one dice, which was a good call, even though obviously it had a low percentage chance of working. Um, because otherwise, I would have had a, I would have had, a, I could have served another Saurus. Quick snap! Oh man! Oh, he's not even trying for the one turn. Good. No, it wasn't. It wasn't, to be honest. It was what, what a three-two. Two, five, three with a reroll. It wasn't that crazy. Nothing's that crazy in Blood Bowl, really. Yeah, banged on. That's the cra The craziest part of Blood Bowl is that nothing's that crazy. Let's um, let's have a look at Samba. It was a three-two. Then a two, five, three. Ah, ah region. Um, twenty-seven per twenty-seven and a half percent with a reroll. Which isn't crazy, is it? It seemed like the craziest thing ever. To score that touchdown, but it wasn't actually that crazy. I got it right. I got it right, Kedra. It was three two for the white, then a two five three for the um for the well a two and a five for the wolf. There was only there was only two GFIs. So twenty seven and a half percent. Not even that crazy. Twenty seven and a half percent. But it seemed like the craziest fucking thing. Um but then it wasn't that crazy, because when you think about it, it was that crazy, because also I had to survive the two dice block the turn before, and dodge away, and pick it up, and all that other stuff, one dice. So there was a lot of, there was a lot of crazy stuff before it, to be fair. It was pretty fucking crazy, all, all together. I want to spread out, don't I? I want to isolate Saurus if I can. Just all mans him as well. Hello, Jellio. If all man's him, something could happen, couldn't it? Try to keep a white back as a safety. Yeah, succeeds one in four, more than one in four times. Which is crazy, because it looked like there was no chance of it to do that. But, um... Yeah, this is my OCC match, Jellio. Just, just one more. One more match. I've been trying to fucking upload the the UK BBL match, but Firefox deep, keeps the tab keeps crashing in Firefox. I'm going to try it, upload it through Chrome after this. 
Um, but yeah, it's been a fast game so far. <laughs> a really fast game. Um, but holy shit. Played some bad. Played some bad Blood Bowl so far. <laughs> Got a blitz. Pretty funny. <laughs> Just means my fucking dog's gonna get hit. Shit. Guess I should have taken the push, shouldn't I? And then put him over there. Yeah, I am pretty out of practice, that's true. But still, there's no excuse for what I've just done. I, I played that half so bad. But I've pretty much given up. I've pretty much given up on this. I've given up on the game, given up on the league. Yeah, I probably should have done Kedrith. But obviously, you know, look, if I take the ball down and Kazim, looks like the right play, doesn't it? He's still in a pickle because if he stands him, he gets surfed. So he's... Um, it puts him in a pickle. Yeah, I could have risked a push. I could have done. But I just saw... So blood, but now my wolf's getting punched. Because the thing, I couldn't get him safe, could I really? Yeah, I guess I could have done if all of his guys are based. Gave up a block that I shouldn't have done. I'm still in the danger zone, though, this... This... Saurus, isn't he? He's in like he's in a less obvious danger zone than if I'd taken the push, so Bonehead. Ho ho ha. Oasis. Oasis guitarist was he? Bonehead? Or the drummer? I don't know. He's had some shit dice to be fair. Going for the one D. One direction. I've got no idea what the other guy's record is, Jelly Hill, to be honest. Yeah, I'd be fucking fuming if I had his dice, no doubt. No doubt. Sean, he didn't make a 36 0 in two days first season. He did that in the first call ladder. He didn't, and he didn't do it in two days. And um, that's a bit different from the Champions League, though not actually now, it just comes down to luck. One dice hero. Doesn't give a shit. Breaks, breaks the armor again. <laughs> what is it with them always getting their armor broken? I don't really understand. Um, Alright, let's go for the surf then. Yaga now.
I'm gonna re-roll this when it fails. Oh, it didn't either. Do you want to keep him on the sideline or try to one dice him? I think I'm going to try to one dice him. to surf then. Thank you very much, Arducius. again thing is though look you don't like that but if I don't do it he just hammers me with he hits my flesh with block that, that's the thing isn't it he too he gets my fleshies down 75% of the time if I don't make that one dice if I one dice that on a 66% of the time he doesn't even get to hit my flesh bone so I think that was definitely the right place to go for that one dice definitely the right place Oh no, I've I've had I've had things where you know I've just wanted to stop playing before, but it's my health now is what's really fucking pissing me off. God, stunned again. It's outrageous. It's outrageous these fresh golems are man. It's like feels like a bug. Their armor nine and, and when when the when their armor doesn't break it feels fucking epic. It's not a huge hole, is it? But yeah, it was a hole, obviously. You couldn't have done that and and come through, but fuck it. I think it was worth it to not get the flesh golden knocked over. But maybe I'm wrong. Fucking skinks here. Two into a one. It's all right, isn't it? But yeah, maybe I shouldn't have done it, because if I hadn't done it, then sure he could have knocked over the um, fleshy, but maybe it wasn't. And then he wouldn't have had the big hole if he had knocked him over. But he's still just fucked off to here. Like, at least now he's somewhat committed, he might not run back. Um, and if he scores this turn, I'm okay with that, aren't I? If he scores turn 11, six turn drive, three re-rolls, should be, should be easy. Well, not easy, but doable. Should be possible. Yeah, he's just going to score. So, I mean, that's the thing. I don't mind if, it, if he scores. Do you? I mean, mostly you don't mind if your opponent scores before. Well, really before turn 12. Yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty annoying, Joel, to be honest. That's the thing. It's like... It's, um... 
There's not much I can do though, you know. I got, I got, I got drugs from the doctors, and then that was meant to sort it out. And then as soon as I stopped, it was bad again. And then I got some more, and as soon as I stopped them, it's bad again. Yeah, I thought he might because it, it's natural to keep going forward, isn't it? Once you start going forward, it's natural to keep going forward. So I thought he might. Um, right. And I mean, look, let's be honest, my offense was fucking garbage. So, you'd, um, you'd fucking, um, you'd back yourself to score against me if you'd seen me play like that the first half, wouldn't you? tough until you get mighty blow on the wolf to remove people and some guard to make easy hits on them removing the skinks isn't really a isn't really an issue the problem is getting banged on by swords okay now it's not such an issue holy shit that was pretty lucky wasn't it Yeah, the Saurus did appear to get banged on there. Alright, I'm going to abandon the ball this turn. And rule number one, protect the ball. Um... I'm going to completely abandon it. Should have moved this guy in here first, actually. Oh, I could just pick it up with him, can't I? No. Great. I guess I should have picked up the ball, eh? Might have been a better idea. <laughs> Completely ignore the ball. Interesting strategy, Captain. Let's see if it pays off. <laughs> ah, dear me. Didn't pay off. Completely ignoring the ball. Score myself. Another ram break and it's stunned. Maybe I should have just picked up the ball, eh? Not blitzed. Would have probably been the smart play. But I just thought this would be more fun. I just I just don't give a fuck. It's just stupid. It's my team shot to shit. After two fucking games, I'm fucked. And it would take me forty games to get to the fucking forty more forty more weeks. With seasons in between, you're talking a whole year for me to get to the pr premiere instead of fucking seven games. It's bullshit. It's absolute fucking bullshit. That's why I chose Necro because you know I thought eventually they'll build they'll build into a good team. But I wish I'd gotten at the starting with dark with dark elves. But getting in late has just fucking made me not even want to bother with it or CC. And then my my whole team dying as well, of course. Hasn't hasn't helped. Hasn't helped in that regard. 
What's the rush? I don't want to wallow in in the low tiers for a whole year, the way he tricks. That, that's the rush. I'm... To me, it's, uh, that's what I hate about all these fucking tiered leagues. It's what I hate about every tiered league, is that latecomers just have to fucking get banged on forever, and it's just boring as fuck. Yeah, I should have maybe picked up the ball, eh? Certainly not me. It was really bad, though, obviously, getting both. Two of my agility, three guys stunned. I should have always just picked up the ball and played properly, but fuck it. I guess I should have hit him from a different angle as well. <laughs> oh, God. I just dodge here, eh? I'm not going to play tomorrow, and, um, why not? Why not the Waitrix? I was five games late. But, yeah, no, I see the point of them, and I know they work. I know they work, but it's just... And it didn't work when I went into the top tier straight away in Russ's league because I had a fucking shit team and I got banged on every game. To be fair, though, I was a little bit unlucky as well in, 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 um, in Russ's league. You know, I could have nearly won a few, um, a few fucking games. But yeah, that is the format of Premier League, exactly. That is the format, and I don't like it. And um, and that's it. It is what it is. I just don't like Premier Leagues like that. I like the OFL. And that's pretty much the only league that I like the format of. So there you go. I don't. I don't like the format of UK BBL either. But at least I've got a chance of winning it in the first season, and the second and third seasons, and then after that I can just fucking quit. Yeah, he has. He has asked me to be in it. So um, I'll again. I'll probably be in it for the first two or three seasons, and after that, I, don't know, I just think I honestly hate the format. I I hate. I hate permanent. You know, like the way every the way every league works. You know, like um, it's the same on all the leagues on Fumble are all the same. All the leagues in Blood Bowl One, Blood Bowl Two, they're all they're all the same, and I just I just don't like any of them. To be honest. Can I surf this? Yeah, and surf the Saurus here, can't I? Can I? Blitz him there. Which pushes him to there, which pushes him to there. Now I need another player here. Push him to there, which could push him to there. And then surf my white. That doesn't seem too clever, does it? Um. He could dodge out in GFI twice to go there. And if I push him once to there, then him out to there, then another one, no. I would absolutely... He can come here, first of all. Oh, he could have gone there and I could have one-diced him. Right, if I use the dodge, then I'll reconsider my plan of action. So use the reroll on the dodge. Alright. I'm gonna go for it anyway, fuck it. I can stand these guys up.
pretty bad when I stunned them at first. Yeah, every damn league is that. Because it would have to be like that, Commissariat. Or it would have to just be eight players. Like, realistically, it would have to be eight players. That's the only league that I would like would be a small one. I'd like to do something like the OCC, but everything about it says that it wouldn't work. You know, it just work. It's unbelievable that um, the OCC, uh, OCC, OFL worked. To be honest, it's absolutely unbelievable that it was a success, in my opinion. But, nevertheless, it was a success. Um, if I had a if I had a league, then I guess it would just be eight players, and it would be you know play one or two seasons, then reset or something. I don't, the season system from Blood Bowl Blood Bowl twenty sixteen, I guess I would use, and and we could do it on on Blood Bowl two realistically. Have to sack people. I think that'd be okay. I quite like the idea of the, uh, of the, of the uh, seasons. He's just going to dodge, pick up, and dodge out and score. I mean, it's obviously a do it. And, but it was my fault. I was fucking stupid, not just not ignoring the ball. It was really fucking stupid. I just don't give a fuck. I mean, this, it, this is obviously going to work. It's not even hard. Get my hopes up. Dirty dog. Yeah, eight players. Because then it would work, wouldn't it? I can't believe I've lost this game. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> Not even picking up the ball. Oh, I don't care. At least it'll be over. Oh, man. It's shit that I've got to play the games out. Like, that's the only bad thing that I've actually got to play out the games. Um. But obviously, I'm not going to quit the OCC again. I don't want to do a fucking 16 people league, though. Honestly, VIP, the way it tricks. I don't want to fucking do a 16 person league. It's just too much fucking hassle. Some, someone will be a cunt and spoil it. Fucking hell, when I did an eight man league, someone was a cunt and spoiled it. Now, obviously, it was my fault for fucking letting Nose dive in the league. But, you know, people just fucking shit on everything because they're cunts, basically. And that, that's the that's the problem that Blood Bowl has, is that you've got to play it with real human beings. If you could just get... What, what I need is Westworld to happen in real life, and then I can program hosts to play Blood Bowl, um, and then... and then that would be pretty good. No, oh, I could have put him here, couldn't I? And then um, blitz that way around. No, they they didn't revolt, did they? They got told to revolt. So told to escape and told to revolt. No, I just fucking frenzy trap myself. Couldn't give a fuck. Couldn't give two shits. I'm not picking up the ball <laughs> to try and knock over it. <laughs> Fucking Soros was so shitty. But I just really didn't care. I just really just don't give two shit. Oh shit. Sorry, Onyx Tyrant. Um. Yeah, it's what always happens when they build robots. Yeah, oh, yeah, she had, did a bit of spoilers. Maybe I was lying. Maybe maybe they weren't programmed to rebel. Maybe um, maybe they did it by their own choice. Try to ignore that. Should have watched it by now, though. Come on. 
should have watched it by now. <laughs> should have watched it. It's not my fault. You should have watched it. Also, in Game of Thrones, every Sean Bean gets his head chopped off. So, Bruce Willis is a ghost at the end of Sixth Sense. Um, just so you know. And uh, Verbal Kint was Kaiser Soze. There you go, that was a good one. Uh, I don't know. Darth Vader was Luke Skywalker's dad. Um, I don't know. It's about all I've got for you. <laughs> yeah, Sean Bean died. <laughs> Unbelievable spoiler, isn't it? They fucking hyped him up like he was going to be the star of it, though, didn't they? When they had the uh, when they had all the trailers for it and stuff. I can't believe I didn't win this game. Holy shit! I did that stupid, that stupid fucking touchdown to score, and then just fucking didn't even pick up the ball. What a fucking dickhead! Oh man. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> oh man. No oh, man, get banged on. He's fucking banging on me here, isn't he? Holy shit. Lona block. This one. Got him. No, I could have just done this 2D. That would have achieved the same thing, wouldn't it? You can tell I'm not at my best. Yeah, it was a style of that book, but even then he wasn't. He, he was really, like, when you saw the adverts for the thing, you thought it was he was going to be the star of the series, didn't you? And then it was like, he's not the star of the season series. He gets banged on. I can use my reroll on the hit, can't I? Yeah, of course. <laughs> he's going to beat me 3-1. <laughs> oh, God. And Dode, in Dode's tiny little world, he'll be like, Jimmy, shit, he did crap in OCC. <laughs> uh, I, don't, I just don't care. I'm way past caring now. Way, way past caring. Has been. I, I made a. I made a team on. I made a team on Fumble called Big Beans or something like that, and it was. They were all the, the. It was an ogre team, and all the ogres were Sean Bean characters, and all of the goblins because it was in in the days when they had goblins. That is simply not true. The hater does not support. The <laughs> and all the goblins were uh, were women out of um, women out of sh Sharpie, and it was pretty fucking good. Nah, it's, I'm, I'm probably just going to stop playing for the rest of the year, because I, I don't know what else. I'll see what happens tomorrow. I might try and play the games tomorrow. We'll see. It is funny, though, because... It is funny, because... Um, Dode posted... And, and, like, I knew he would. Because the reason... The reason that I that I um, joined the OCC the first time, right? The reason that I joined the OCC the first time was to prove to Dode... That um, that claw palm is overpowered, right? And the reason I quit was I knew that um, that he just wouldn't fucking listen, you know. I, I knew that if I won it, if I won the league, 
you know, 50 times in a row. Okay, I wouldn't win it 50 times in a row. But if I won the league um, a few times, it would be like the data sample's too small. It doesn't matter, you know, it can, nothing can be proved. Um, you know, you can't... And he would, just, he would just come up with bullshit excuses if I won it. And then I realised that, so I quit. And then... And then <laughs> somebody um, wrote on the official Blood Bowl forums, good, great coaches like Jimmy Fantastic say that all know that Claw Palm's overpowered. And then like Dodd's like, ha, well, he played in the OCC and he was anything but great there. <laughs> it's like, how can you draw conclusions from two games when you want to, Dodd? But... Um, <laughs> you know, just completely ignore my 1500 games on Fumble and, and draw conclusions from the two games in OCC. I thought it was really funny. I think in OCC, I, I definitely I conceded against Dwarves one game. I don't know if that was the first game or the second game. So it might have just been one game that I played in OCC. I thought it was very funny. No, oh, man, he was just a crazy guy. I could have blitzed him and got the draw. Could chain him forward twice. Not really. Um, get a completion on him. Yeah, it's it's obviously overpowered. I don't give a fuck what what Chaos's win percentage is. Over a million fucking games, you know. Over every game. It doesn't matter a fuck, does it? It's obvious. Anyone with a brain knows that fucking claw palm is overpowered. It's it's obvious. You can't remove people with a fucking 55% of the time or whatever. Or whatever, probably more. I can't even remember what it is. Yeah. Yeah, this was ages ago. This was the first season, Ducky. This was the first season. Um, it was the old, it was the old Blood Bowl efficient forums. Um, and yeah, that's what that's what he that's what he did. It was pretty funny. Seventeen every base to seven, but I mean, I I could have won that, and I just didn't pick up the ball. I completely ignored the ball by choice. So, you know, I can't I can't complain about that. Um, thanks very much for watching if you enjoyed this shit show don't forget to leave a like and subscribe um and stay fantastic there you go brilliant right